Coping with Bereavement, Murley, posted on Thursday, September 29, 2005, 9.58 a.m. Hi, Billy. What advice would you give to someone coping with loss, for example, the end of a relationship or a bereavement? Thanks, Matt. Answer. This differs from individual to individual. Ten persons may have the same problem, but you have to give them ten different advices, depending on their thinking, feeling, and reacting. Thomas posted May 2009. Hello, Mr. Meyer. It seems to me that the loss of a loved one through their death is one of the most painful events experienced by people in general as a part of normal life. I have read in Figu materials that becoming too attached and not being able to let go of some things or circumstances is not good because it sets a person up to suffer more. I understand that people die as a natural part of life, but my question is, what can we do to ease the pain of losing a loved one? I am familiar with some of the Figu materials on the subject of death, so I believe I understand it to a fair degree. However, to be honest, I feel like it would be of little comfort to me if I were to lose someone very, very close to me. So to restate my question, how can one really minimize the suffering that is felt when someone close to them has died? Thanks for your responses, and I hope you and your loved ones are in good health. Thomas Answer. People must occupy themselves with birth, life, dying, and death throughout their entire life, starting when they are a small child. And through his entire life, a person must never enter into too close relationship, bond with another person. There must always be kept a certain amount of distance between oneself and the other human beings, even in a family or in a marriage. If this is observed, the chance is high that the surviving person may overcome grief and pain much faster and easier. The suffering can be minimized if a person is thinking reasonably and is living in reality, which means to accept the reality of death, etc., and to understand the true realty of death, etc. If people are occupying themselves with death and dying throughout their lives, they have a better chance to learn how to cope with the loss of a loved one.